Alright, well, uh, I'm back with Brunswick's Dracula now for the Super Nintendo. Probably a game no one have, has ever heard about, I'm pretty sure. That's okay. Uh, that's why I'm showing it. So, what lies in Halvin Falk is much easier. So I'm gonna do a normal difficulty, it's just... It's all the, it's all the stages, so we're gonna go in 3, 2, 1, go. So there's a trainer difficulty too, that's just a couple stages just to get into the game, that's why it's called trainer difficulty. Trainer, it doesn't sound... You also have hard difficulty, it just makes the enemies faster, like really fast. Uh, I should actually press start then to make the book open. Good thing. Uh, this game is just a platformer, it's uh, only one on already. I got this little ass dagger, just garbage. So we're gonna go to this guy, and um, yes, he shows there's a sword. There it is. So we're gonna do, we're gonna be, uh, we're gonna do easy strats. We're just gonna go through this part. <laughs> it's actually faster to go blow, slightly faster, I guess, if you do it correctly. So we get this long sword. I don't know why we don't get it like instantly in this game, but I don't know. The Genesis, the Genesis version actually, you start out with the long sword. Also, the Genesis version is slightly different. There are some slightly different things in the stage, or stages are just different in general. Also, there's a random boulder to just hit you. I don't know why they put that there, but okay. So, here's a boss. Oh, I still got hit. Okay. There we go. So this is based on the book. Yes, I think the book came first, but it's just based on that, I guess. Or based on the movie, based on the book or something, I don't know. Weird. So you basically play, uh... I think Harker is his name, according to that. Or, yeah, I think so. I have never put myself into the lore of this game at all. It's just, it's just basically the same as the book, just, the, just out to kill Dracula. So we're gonna jump over these flies because these flies hurt. So actually, we need to go to this guy every time. Uh, in stages like these, uh, we need to do that to make the exit appear. <coughs> so if we don't do that, we, the exit doesn't appear. Also, he shows a sub weapon, but literally, there's only one stage we're gonna grab a sub weapon from because uh, it's closest, and the sub weapons are just basically not useful at all. So we destroy this orb. It opens a path, a like shortcut. Oh, so this is a great part in the game. So, <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, monkey ass. So we need the the thing you need to do is you need to stand in between those things. Uh, and I played this game as a child, and I play I even played it on the uh, the PAL version, so it's even slower. But I never knew what the hell I was, what I was supposed to do there. So you're supposed to be in between those spikes, and it's pretty tight. Like it's not easy at all. I don't know how a kid is supposed to play this game, but okay. You can just you can just YOLO. If you have full health, you can just run through it, and you can still die. Anyway, there's a dragon. His fire has a great hitbox. He just burned my head and it doesn't do any damage. Okay, that was a really, really fast fight. Oh my god, that was fast. That was absolutely fast. That was really fast, not gonna lie. Probably the fastest I've ever done. So now we're getting chased by the three wives of Dracula. So I need to make sure I don't fall in here. And we done it. So if you actually fall in there, uh you mess up the timing of those boulders. If you don't fall in there, you can just keep running to the right. You don't have to stop whatsoever. But if you fall, uh, it actually messes up the, ti the timing for that. And hey, we got this jump. This jump is actually just slightly faster. Just jump down there so we don't have to fall down. It's actually slightly faster. Guess what? Another boss. So this is Dracula, I guess. Hey, we killed him before he even hit me. That was a really good fight. Wow. Alright, so far it's pretty good. 
At least I'm not bad at this game. <laughs> oh, w watching the stream in the living room. That's 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 life. That's life, dude. Much luck. Thanks, dude. I definitely need the luck for the next game. The game after this I'm doing. I need a lot of luck for that. Easy jump. Uh, I'm gonna jump in this bucket. Oh, no, or not! Or, or we just not jump on the bucket at all. Oh, yeah. This has never happened before. Okay, okay. That's a first. I've never, never ever jumped over the bucket. That's, uh, that's a first. So this has definitely never happened before. How late were you just jumping the bucket? <laughs> Supposed to jump on the bucket, so I'm just gonna slide. Oh, never mind. I was supposed to slide under it. Is this John Wick the video game? Yes, it is. Obviously, so I can slide under both those bags, but uh, I messed up. So I was supposed to jump on the bucket earlier and then jump to a platform to go a little bit faster, but I completely missed the bucket. And literally, this never happens. So if I kill these spiders, they spawn on top of you, like above, and they can spawn on top of you. So I'm, I don't bother killing them at all. Killing this one. Okay, this is guy. He's gonna destroy it a bit, so I need to jump before I actually destroy it. Okay, good. I fell down. It's good. Ah, pfft. okay. So, fun thing: if there are two enemies overlapping, you only hit one. Great design. It's good. It's good game design. If you, if there's two enemies overlapping, you can only hit one. It's perfectly how it works, right? Dude, it's gonna be dressed like Han Solo. <laughs> Why is Han Solo killing Dracula? I don't know. Basically a crossover, obviously. He's a god game. Kill the spider. Kill this rat, because I'm gonna jump up there. Guess what? I need to kill another rat, or else that one's gonna hit me. Perfect. That was literally perfect. So, those enemies, the one without torches... They take two hits. The one with torches take three hits. I don't know why. Apparently, holding a torch in your hand uh, increases your defense. Makes you lets you take one more hit. And there's a lot of those in here. So here's the only uh, only sub weapon I can pick up. Pick up the stakes. I think that's how you call how you call it stakes, right? Yeah, he exactly looks like Han Solo. I'm not gonna lie. I've only seen the movie, not gonna lie, I've only seen the movie, because it's Keanu Reeves. Oh, great. So, uh, you're supposed to just stop and just walk slowly to kill these enemies. You just need to hit them instantly, but one of them, when I fell off a, uh, fell off a latch, that one is really difficult to actually hit. So, kill this skeleton. That can be a little bit lag here for some reason. Also, if I don't, don't jump. If I don't jump over that, uh, if I don't jump there, I, I fall in a pit and it uh, is slower. So here's a great uh, example of good game design. Oh, never mind. Ah! Okay, there we go. Well, that's uh, it's good game design. If you walk into the wall and turn around without moving a single pixel, you do not get hit. And this... <laughs> Uh, I'm pretty sure I can do the fight faster, but I never, I, I never bothered myself to actually try to do this fight faster. Uh, I'm pretty sure doing that fight is faster. Also, I use the stakes. I need to make sure I use the stakes when I'm not. Like, if I hit him at the same time, I think it doesn't do double damage or anything, but... This is an invisible guy, this is a lever. So, I'm not gonna lie, so far this run is going pretty good. Uh, just wait till the next, uh, the next stage is terrible. The next stage can ruin my whole run, like, can ruin your run. It's one of the stages that can actually ruin the run. It's just absolutely the worst. So, we kill this enemy. It's right there. You can see it. Fuck this guy. Oh, there's, there's stakes, but they're, they're, but they're there. Like, getting sub weapons is absolutely slow. So, uh, yeah, up next is the worst stage. What is that emo dude? What is that? What is that monkey? F so this is why, this is the reason why this stage is the worst. Look at all these enemies. Look at all these enemies spawning. Look at this. So... Ah, don't, don't die, have one health left! Oh my, no! Oh my god, no! Oh! 
I get hit now, I get spawned to the beginning. You guys gotta turn around. Oh. Uh, oh my god. No! <laughs> I have one hit left. Or else I get spawned back to the to that checkpoint. Please don't kill me here. Please don't kill me. So, uh, I've only done it once. Like, the first whole part before the checkpoint. I have once done it. Like, that I kept running to the right without ex actually stopping. And I killed all the enemies. So if you can do that, you can also run through this whole part too. And basically save a lot of time. Stop spawning skeletons, dude! Dude, these skeletons keep spawning! Okay, we survived. We actually survived. So I'm gonna take an intentional death here. Because why not? Because I need my health. I actually need my health. Oh. No! 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 What? No! <laughs> This is dumb. This whole his whole fight is dumb. The whole fight is dumb. I thought I could have survived. Never mind. So these boulders are just stupid. This fight is just dumb. Bistral. Oh what? Yeah. Okay. That's that's one of the worst stages in this whole game. Uh, I think I did decent enough. So, yeah, you can actually just keep running through the ride and kill all the enemies if you're fast enough. Huh? Dude, that zombie... I didn't even attack the zombie, he just disappeared. That's, uh, that's also never happened before. I didn't even attack! He just disappeared! It was like, yeah, I'm not gonna bother you. Also, nice, he just spawns on, like almost behind the pillar, it's great. This guy, can I make a platform? No, I cannot. Here we go. Ha! Ah, some gr great pa platforming right here. Oh my god, monkas! So there's actually a checkpoint here. Uh, I'm not sure why. Look, this is a checkpoint here, but guess what? There are no enemies in this part. There's literally no enemies in this part, and you cannot get any fall damage whatsoever. So that checkpoint is basically useless. I. <laughs> I have no idea why there is a checkpoint there. Like, it's not even useful. Like, we get a checkpoint when we get at the boss. It's literally on the right, and there's a checkpoint. Just basically when you start the fight, it's literally a checkpoint. I don't know why. Weird. There's a... There's a wolf. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Damn you. Okay, that was... Yeah, it was, yeah, it was good, I guess. Um, this is definitely gonna be sub-20 run. Maybe sub-19? Well, probably not, but... You know, uh, it depends. If I can get a sub-19, I actually have to make sure that I don't have to use a uh, continue. Like, most of my runs uh, are getting continues literally at the last days, because I, if I die way too much, I... Like, for marathon, safety always. For actual speed runs, maybe not. So I actually still got, uh, I still got four lives left and four health. Yo, good <laughs> game. So I'm literally attacking there and that enemy just decided to throw a bottle in my face. Also, those enemies are really fast when they're in front of you. And on the hard difficulty, they're even faster. Like, they're just like really fast. Oh, jump. Jump, dude. Still made the cycle though, anyway, doesn't matter. Uh, uh, dude, I'm a miss, I almost missed that. Still throwing bottles at me. So now we need to collect this book for a uh, for a bookcase. So this guy just spawns because spawning in this game is just dumb. They keep just like you saw early in the, that one stage where where the skeleton kept spawning, and it's dumb because that skeleton if it overlaps the enemy uh, cannot hit both enemies when they're on top of each other. So yeah, that was dumb. Also, there's a slight lag here. Uh, two enemies. Uh, stop lagging. So, this could be a decent run. This could be a pretty good run, not gonna lie. So, yeah. If I jump over the first one, I can get pushed through the right one and actually make a cycle. I can still make the cycle, possibly. Can I make the cycle? Nope, never mind. Um. Ah. Oh my god! No! Stop! 
Oh my god. Okay, done. Don't die. No! <laughs> I have one hit left, and if I get hit now, I get pushed back be before those platforms, and yeah. They just kind of dumb too with the, the fireballs. So you actually get knocked back in this game. Uh, so, probably gonna die here. So, yeah, you get knocked back. So, if you actually jump in the air. Bleh, didn't want to do that. So, if you actually jump and you get hit by a fireball, you can just knock back right into the fire. Monk ass, dude. Okay. I survived! I magically survived this whole stage. Yes! I didn't die at all. So, this is. Definitely gonna be a really good run. I don't have to use a continue at all, I think. So, yes, if I don't, like, if I get hit once and I die, I don't have to use a continue anyway. So, this fight is probably gonna get hit or something. Okay, sometimes this part, uh, sometimes when we are on the left, uh, it lags the game. Also, Sometimes he just stands still there, and now he just decided to walk left again. Just I don't understand this whole boss fight. It's just random. So here's Dracula. He's really smart. Look, he's really smart. Uh, see? Good AI. I, <laughs> I swear, this is gonna be a pretty good run. If I actually do this next day, it's like really good gonna be close to pb well so that's world record maybe even a pb probably not but we don't know at least i don't know i'm probably gonna get a sub 19 possibly or just below 19 if i don't game over or whatever ah, oh what the fuck oh. that's okay no that's okay, it's perfectly fine. I already not died right there, just wanna die for it on. Oh my god, that air huh. Nope. Nope, nope, so arrows I think they're just maybe random or something, I don't know. Okay, we survived that part, or at least we didn't Hold down. So here, this is one of the dumb parts of this whole stage too. Okay, we survived that part, so we have still have more parts left of this whole stupid dungeon or stage. This part is also really dumb. Not gonna lie. Those knights can instantly spawn right behind me. Oh, come on, kill! Oh, no. I'm waiting for this one. I cannot do anything uh, to him. Oh, I was dying! Monka asked. Oh. Don't get hit here. Oh. Okay, good. Oh. If I had more health, I'd just YOLO it, but. So. If I don't die here, oh my god, <laughs> dude, I'm dying. oh my god, oh my god, is this is going to be a uh, pretty good time, so his final boss is not, it's going to be sub 90 possibly, so when I kill his boss it's time, okay, there we go, okay, uh, I can do this boss without looking at the screen, so this is going to be sub 19 run, holy crap. The time is coming up soon. And time! There we go, dude. Yo, <laughs> that's a pretty good time, not gonna lie. What's my PB though? Let me check what my PB is. Yo, yeah, that was my PB! Dude, I almost PB'd. <laughs> what the hell? Literally, I got literally my PB. What? If I didn't die at the, the, the lady in the whites, I could have got world record. What? I dumb. Uh could have been could have been a PB so it's world record. <laughs> uh more American than getting PB, dude, that's insane. Yeah, it, I just literally got a like 
the time I got now is actually what my PB is. So that's kind of sucks that I, that that lady in the white actually got the fight actually went terrible. Damn it! <laughs> but oh well. I thought that was a good run. Yeah, it was pretty good. Not gonna lie, it was really good. This is like the best run I've had since ages. You no, know, I don't really run this game that much. back and run it again because apparently you're god gamer dude i'm god gamer hell yeah god gamer all right <laughs> thank you for the run lincoln meister up next we have lincoln meister again again what <laughs> sonic last man 2 holy frick it's gonna be oh, insane yeah. stay tuned guys we're gonna run a quick ad be sure to turn off your ad blocker it really helps us out helps the nasa channel out so that we can put on events like this so stay tuned guys we'll be right back with more high quality, high intensity, speed gaming. 